Angeles says his website has been hacked by the terror group ISIS, raising red flags in many circles. Tonight, KKLI's Lori Perez is live in Koreatown with more on the alleged online attack. Lori. Susie, his real name is Rami, but his fans know him as Kosha Dills. He's trying to build a name as the best Jewish rapper from Koreatown. Very negative vibes right now. Definitely want to go through and put on some tequila and show some love. And uh, yeah, see what's good. Oh, hopping out the way. Yep. What's your name? Uzi. This Uzi. is me and Uzi. Is it Uzi? Kosha? I'm so Kosha okay. Dills. It's very good. It's okay. very nice, you know. You like this? Huh? Yeah, I like this. It's good. So we're here. The other day problems. Today we still put it to filling on, right? That's right. That's right. Doesn't matter where you are in the world, still do it. Good. Um, pretty like soft voice right now because it's just kind of dark times and trying to just pay homage to all the people that were here. Um, this is the guy David. He's a cool, cool cat. He was here yesterday. Gotta chop it up with him. And uh, yeah, man. He had no reason to come into this. He wasn't oppressed. He wasn't living in the restricted neighborhoods. He had a normal life. One morning, one fine morning, two men He comes along, just car which is parked outside, and walks into the synagogue, which he knew about in advance, and just slaughters as, as many people as possible. If I was a senior military advisor, then I would have to give you advice. Um, as a religious believing Jew, we have to continue to live as religious Jews. We have to continue to do what God wants us to do. We have to become better people. We have to care more about what's going on. We have to be more kind to people. We have to continue acting the way we need to act. And we believe that God will take care of those who need to take care of. Just not simple. We have to go on. So now and, uh, there were such special people. Yeah, I know them all personally, and, and they're such such special people. And we can't understand it. But uh, Hashem, we're a strong Asian. We've been through a lot, and uh, it's just going to continue. What's your plan today? Hanging at the shul with my homies on the street, rapping on the beats like we know it can't complete. You can't make it better. Oh, dude, it's good. Dude, it's good. Ah. <laughs> I, ra I rap for a lot of Jewish, Jewish people. Box, give me the beatbox. I'll do the rap. Rapping in the street with my homies, chilling at the synagogue, and my kitty's lonely. We got the B representing for the fat caps and shell toes and hard note. The flow is mellow, yellow like ooh. Kicking it, ripping it, the flow, this is ness. Okay, it makes no sense if we so infant. Oh, <laughs> he's still going. Harn Elf. This is me. That's where the bullets were. Some rabbis up there. Some dude just rolled up and said, uh, Who do I speak to? Because I have some extra blood from the other day, which is kind of trippy. It's still, as, as crazy as that sounds, still good spirits, and I'm just, this guy David is doing like interviews with every single country literally in the world, Germany, Sweden, Holland, America, Canada, um, and there's all kind of stuff going on right now, everyone's getting interviewed, there's lights here, there's people on cranes, and boxes, the Congo, the Australian uh, ambassador to Israel. What's going on today in Israel is not just for the Jewish people, it's for the world. Yeah. You know, the, the tragedy that uh, uh, the Jewish are facing today is not just for them, it's for us. It all felt everywhere. In Africa, the whole wild world, we felt that pain. That's why we're all here, to show the support that, you know, they're not alone. Okay, we are there for them, and uh, we get to stand with them, mm -hmm. you know. Definitely. So, you called your mom yesterday? Yeah, no, she, was... she didn't answer. She, I called my dad. I told him come. I was like, okay, okay. And she was stoked that you were yeah, alive. I was freaked out. Yeah. 
She was happy. But she was like crying over the phone. Or? So I called my dad and I talked to him. So you called your dad. What your dad say? So I was gonna call him. They called like, well, what happened? And I told him there's a, there's people shooting and stuff. So so I told him. He's like, okay, I'll come, I'll come. You live up there. What floor you live on? One. Yeah, they're from Sharapat. Wow. What's your plan today? Um, well, I'm here learning in this place, and I feel all the learning done is a little bit of connecting with the people that were nifter and were, uh, that were killed, and uh, continuing things they would have wanted us to do. It's just that each one has something else to teach us. I know that they, each one excelled in something else, and it's for us to take uh, to learn from them, take their ways. I know that I picked up certain. Uh, Spend time thinking about different things and ways I can come better through. I'm kind of like working on this song and kind of like I did it. I knew them, but I didn't know them yet, you know. And I'm just gonna meet them a day late because I was arriving. You know, I'm just like come up, you know. So, yeah, the main thing is we, 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 we can use everything to grow from mm -hmm. closer to Hashem, closer to God, and uh, it's nicer to each other, closer to each other. Yeah, because so we use everything to grow from. No event, you just get to keep studying. Yeah, yes, yeah, so sure. Studying better. That's better. it. Awesome. You should uh, share good news. So.